Hi guys, hope you all are doing good. Welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I am gonna share with you the details of enforcement bars for the construction of double cell box culvert. In order to understand this concept, don't forget to watch this video completely and also like, share with your friends. You may see here that we are having the reinforcement bars. They are being placed for the decking of this double cell box culvert. Reinforcement bars are also being placed for the wing walls, toe beam. While we are laying these reinforcement bars of decking, we are also going to put reinforcement bars of the head wall. You can see when we had constructed these wing walls, you may observe here that the starter bars are coming out from the apron of wing walls. Similarly for the walls, we had placed the starter bars so that they can be connected with the reinforcement bars of the decking. For the walls, decking, wing wall and the head walls, we have used Y10 and Y12 mm bars. This is the diameter which we have used. For the spacing, we maintain 20 to 25 centimeters from center to center. You can observe here. When we had placed the reinforcement bars of head wall, we had to make sure that the reinforcement bars were remaining inside the decking. At least it was kept at 10 centimeters below the level of decking. You can also see that the horse benches had been placed so that the bars which are at the bottom can be kept away from the top. Apart from these horse benches, you can also observe that the concrete spacers had been used. Guys, if you want, you may also use damp proof membrane whenever you are constructing the decking. However, if you want, you may still cast concrete without the need of damp proof membrane. So guys, thank you so much for watching this video. If you have any comments, you may write in the comment box. So until my next video, goodbye.